Hey guys, we're here at that. Uh, we're here at the P2I booth, CES 2011. This is one of the coolest exhibits we've seen so far, and uh, we're going to hear what they're all about. Okay, this is a, a standard tissue, and uh, everybody realizes how that works. So if we put water on it, you're seeing water is just being absorbed exactly as you expect with a normal tissue. And if we put it in water, there's just normal tap water in here. Then, as you'd expect, it's absorbing water, and the tissue has become completely wet and weak uh, as everybody's used to in everyday life. This is uh, an identical tissue that's been treated by P2I's uh, process and it has uh, a polymer coating on it. It's identical in appearance and identical in feel because the coating is so thin so it doesn't change the way the uh, substrate works at all and if we put water on it you can see the water cannot wet the surface and it's it looks as if it's mercury, it's moving all over and it's just not wetting the, materi the material at all. And if we take the tissue and immerse it completely in water, and we don't need to be gentle, we can move it all around and take it out and just shake it when it comes out to get the water off. And the tissue is absolutely dry. There's no wet surface at all. So if you want to just pull that around and scrunch it up, so you see I'm not doing that, it's absolutely dry to the touch. That's incredibly cool. It's perfectly dry and it was just stuck in the bottom of water. That's very cool. P2I here at CES 2011, some of the upcoming technology. Where can we find more about you guys? Uh, if you go to our website, p2i.com, you can see all the promotional videos that are here on the stand and it gives a good explanation of the technology that we're using to put down this innovative coating. And although we're showing it here on tissues and we're uh, pushing it forward for use on PCBs and handheld devices, it can also be used on textiles and metals to give protection against not only corrosion, but uh, fingerprints and scratching. Awesome. That's Nazi iPhone guy coming from uh, CES 2011. And as always, stay snazzy. See you later, folks.